Hey guys, I'm Sasha, a news reporter at Waroni, and this is a weekly wrap-up for week two. The first student representative council of the year was held on Wednesday. Over five hours, many different motions were debated, including college representative funding, a new sponsorship guidelines, and debit card policies, and the upcoming governance review. Waroni also obtained an exclusive look at the recommendations provided by outside consultants to ANUSA about constitutional changes that might be made to the SRC. The controversial review began in 2018 and was mostly forgotten about by the student population. It saw changes such as less positions on the SRC, the addition of a welfare officer to ANUSA, and the inclusion of a club's council executive member in the executive. The ANU has also announced that it will offer up to $5,000 to international students who are currently stuck overseas after the COVID-19 coronavirus outbreak and are unable to make it back to campus to begin their studies for the year. The travel ban has recently been extended to Iran and South Korea and is continuously being extended by the federal government. That's Sasha signing off with the weekly wrap-up for week two. Enjoy your long weekend, guys, and happy Canberra Day. Good morning, Canberra. This is Woroni's campus news. So after last month, we saw some hail here, here and here. We saw some bushfire smoke here. We saw the actual bushfires here. And so recently we've been seeing too much water here. Actually too much water everywhere. We're begging you, please let it stop raining. Good night, Canberra. Back to you, Sasha.